Deion Jordan is a, a man child, okay? He goes hard every snap, every single snap. There is no, there's no second gear with Deion. There's no, no other speed but full speed every play, all day, all long. I've never been around a player. I'm sure I've been around a couple, but in, in the most recent years, I've never been around a guy like Dion that can go and go and go. And uh, not only can he go, he's a playmaker. Led the team with sacks this year. How important is it going to be that he gets pressure on Russell Wilson? Well, obviously, it's going to be real important. I mean, that's kind of an interesting question. But anyway, it's going to be important that we get some pressure on Russell Wilson when we have a chance. But Dion is a guy that we're counting on to, to do some of that. And uh, he'll show up on uh, January 2nd. I know that. I guess it's the goal to kind of keep him contained in the pocket. The overall goal is to try to win the game and have one more point than Wisconsin does. That's the first goal. The second goal is to make sure we stop the run and hopefully win first down and then when we get him in long yardage situation uh, then we'll you know hopefully get a chance to pin our ears back and, and get after the quarterback. Russell Wilson's a very good quarterback. He's a scrambler. Uh, yeah we'd like to keep him in the pocket but uh, no, not everybody's done that on a regular basis. He's a very good athlete but I hope that we can. Uh, last question, how, how uh, much impact, input did you have with him switching from tight end to defense a couple years ago? I don't know if I had any other than the fact that when they said, do you want to take him, I jumped up and down off the table and said, absolutely, let's take him. So if that counts as an impact, then I had a little bit. <laughs> Nick, for your staff, you guys have been in these BCS Bowls, you know the drill. Does that help in preparation for your staff, getting your team ready for this? Absolutely, Jerry. I think that our guys, you know, having been there before, the, the game's certainly not going to be too big for them. You know, Rose Bowl two years ago, BCS Bowl last year, the big game opening up at LSU, uh, the big venue for the Pac-12 championship. Uh, these guys have been in big stages, so, I mean, it's not, the bright lights aren't going to get to them. Uh, and, and yes, I, I should get to the preparation and, and their mindset. I think it's, we're a lot more keen and a lot more attuned and we're, we're really into this uh, early into the practices and sometimes that's hard to do when they know there's you know, 17 days or whatever it is before we still play a game. Does the fact that you guys are a little fresh, I mean, Wisconsin will be too, but I mean, is there a, is there a snap in the step? You guys a little fresher for practices coming into this game? I see that and uh, it's great, it's fun, uh, they're into it. They're, they're jumping around, they're bouncing around. Uh, yeah, I think both teams will probably be at full strength, and I think that'll be a key, and, and Coach Kelly will make sure that we, you know, we take care of our guys' bodies so that we, we can be at full strength and playing at our fastest on uh, January 2nd. Are coaches, players able to appreciate the moment? You're in the Rose Bowl again. I mean, another BCS game. Uh, can you appreciate where you are and, and enjoy it, or, or is, the, is the pressure to succeed so much that you don't really get a chance to do that? I will tell you this, when you ask me that question, and this is not about me, but I get emotional over it. When I step on that field of the Rose Bowl, that's a big deal. Uh, pressure is what you feel when you don't know what you're doing. Um, just the moment, playing in a big game like that. When you're a kid, you grow up on the West Coast. The Rose Bowl is the game. Now they have a BCS championship game. That's kind of the game. But, uh, and I'd like to be back to that one too, but when it's all said and done, the Rose Bowl has always been the granddaddy of them all. And uh, there's no other feeling like when you step on the field for the Rose Bowl. So uh, yeah, I'm getting older, so I get caught up a little bit in the emotion of it. Uh, it's not about me, but it's a big deal and uh, there is no pressure. It's just, let's go out and play the best we can and, you know, best team win. Thanks.